want to introduce you to my dear friend, Misty Daniel. Misty is in Conroe. She's about, what, about 40 minutes outside of Houston? Yes. Now, tell me real quick. In your entire life, you've been born and bred in Texas. Have you ever seen anything like this? No, we, you know, we, we do hurricanes. That's, you know, we're used to that. We, we're prepared, but uh, this, this has been unbelievable. It's, no, nobody was prepared for this. Oh my gosh, Misty, we've been worried about you. It's so good to see your face. Tell me yesterday what you encountered when you and Shane, your husband, went to go volunteer. Uh, yesterday was the first day we've gotten out of the house since Friday. Um, and we went, we loaded up the car with donations, clothes, blankets, things like that. Um, we loaded up stuff from the neighbors. We went to a couple of the places that I had seen people posting on Facebook that these were places that were housing people and taking donations. And uh, we went to three different places and we were told that they had too many volunteers and to please call tomorrow um, before you come. And um, they, I heard last night that places were no longer accepting donations, that they had too much stuff already. Um, they're they're oh. really whittling it down to more specific things that they need now. Um, but even as we're, we're, like you said, about 40 miles north of Houston and um, things around here have flooded. And so even, even people here are out of their homes and, and needing everything they left with nothing tell me that story about that one man you saw what he was carrying and it seemed kind of like an odd pair um when i was waiting in line it was amazing i had pulled up and there were five or six cars in front of me and people volunteers running in and out in the rain to take donations out of people's cars uh and so i was waiting in line to empty my car again and there was a, an elderly man he got out of his truck with a cane he could barely walk around and they got out the biggest box of diapers I've ever seen. Oh. They donated a couple of giant boxes of diapers and a giant box of uh, baby wipes. And he shook the guy's hand and, and he drove away. It was just, it was, it, it's amazing to see the, the things that people are thinking about. Right, right. Thank you so much for talking to us this morning. I know you'll probably be back out to the, the shelters in the coming days to try to volunteer again. So. Be safe. I love you. Give my love to love Mimi, you. honey, and Sunny, and I will talk to you later.